Hello, Xavier here, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Essentials series, and yet again, making another map. Um, so yeah, so today we're going to be making a Route 1. So, this one is a bit different because this one is designed by my sister. Um, I've asked her to actually um, help me out with one of the maps, and I've told her to do Route 1. My friend Silver, uh, you may know him, you may not. Is going to be doing the first town. I've already worked on the second town and the forest as well. And you guys already saw that. But let's move on. We're going to do Route 1. I'm going to show you this rough sketch she actually did. And by God, she did a lot right there. So I have a lot to work with right now. Only thing is, I'm going to be taking that map, flipping it around, and changing a few things. I've already mentioned this to her. And if you're watching this, hey sis. <laughs> so let's get right into this. And it's going to be a pretty long episode. This one's going to be... Um, I want to say long episode, but a pretty long process. So the speed run is going to be longer than usual. I, I'm thinking about an hour of work for this one map. Uh, so let's get right into this.
Alright guys, so as you can see, I have finally completed Route 1. Now, it was a bit difficult because, you know, I had to take what she made and turn it around. But I, I think at the end of the day, it turned out pretty well. I don't know, what, what do you think? Because I know my sister's watching this, so let me know what you think down in the comments, you know. Uh, but I, I've thought of some interesting ideas for this map in particular, which is going to be really cool. And I might use this idea that I have in mind for some other ideas and other maps and stuff, which is really cool. Uh, but let's let's see how this looks in game. Uh, I'm going to connect this map with the actual town, and I'll see you guys when I'm doing that right away. Alright guys, so as you can see here, I'm in the game. This is my test character, and I have some really cool stuff I can do. But what we're going to do is we're going to go right down here, which is... Oh, I can't run yet. I forgot about that. Uh, we're going to go down here. And we're going to connect this area to the other one. So what we're going to do is go here to the debug. And we're going to go to information, editors, edit metadata. And then we're going to go to route one, right? So here you are, route one. Okay, we're going to go to the, make sure that it's set to outdoor. So that way, you know, the, uh, the actual nighttime happens whenever. Uh, then we're going to go to, let's see, snap edges. Yes. We're going to do that. Now we're going to connect the maps. So edit map connections. So we are in this town, right? Uh, no, I do not want to. Okay, so I want to make sure that I can connect that area. So let's go to, let's do route one. Let's do route one, right? And we're going to, we're going to move it around. I'm gonna make sure we can move it around about there. So that looks good, right? Right there should be fine. And we're gonna save changes. Yes. Exit editor. Yes. And we're gonna go back, and we're gonna see. Whoa! Oh my God! Oh, oh my God! This this uh, uh oh okay. This is uh, some interesting uh things. Let me let me go back and. Do this all over again. All right, guys. There we go. So I fixed the problem. Basically, what I did, uh, what I did was I just took out the snap edges. So if you guys don't know snap edges, what it does is you know make sure that whenever I hit the border of the map, it doesn't focus on me. But I'm gonna have to fix this later on. But as you can see, I took out the snap edges, so we're able to see the black areas of the maps. But at least this works which is really cool now you can go in the town and look at that right there now of course the route one is gonna have a different theme but let's check out the map you know let's let's check it out on foot you know uh, what do you guys think so of course there are some things I'm gonna be fixing of course uh, like I won't be able to walk on these and I was thinking of getting some animated flowers for this specific stuff uh, but yeah th that's how it's gonna go so of course you know you got the grass there are no Pokemons in this area. There's going to be some items here, of course. going to have these areas. Can I go up, of course? This is going to go down to a specific area, which I will talk about in another video, which is going to be grottos, um, which I'm going to have to do myself. Uh, this is going to make sure I let you know, oh, go north to go to the town, go south to go to that last route, and then go, you know, west for the beginner town. And, uh... Yeah, this is a little other area we're going to be going through. You can either go this way or that way. But at the end of the day, it's going to lead to the same place. So this is a pretty long cliff, as you can see here. A pretty, pretty long cliff. And uh, there will be NPCs here. Do not worry. There will be some NPCs here. So it's going to be very cool. I can't wait to get started on it. But as you can see, no town here. So until we actually have a map sketch for the town... Uh, that area will not be ac acceptable or you know accessible as well as the one in the bottom which I can show you right now if I you know I should I probably should have made myself able to run <laughs> but I didn't so we're gonna we're gonna go this way let's, let's go this way there we go so right down here is another route that we can go into but that will be in for a later later like a lot later in the uh, in the game so yeah 
guys thank you guys for watching today's video of Pokemon Essentials and I you, you saw how we do the you know the map connection and snaps and you don't want to do snaps if there's a map connection so just a little warning out there so you guys won't do the same mistake I did uh, but thank you guys for watching you know uh, really uh, thank you guys for watching the series and uh, let me know down in the comments what you guys think what I could improve and yeah thank you guys for watching I'll see you next time see ya